Happy Friday, fellow friends and other people. Fellow friends and other people. Friends and other people. I haven't had my morning coffee yet, you can tell. Welcome to another edition of Before My Morning Coffee. This morning we're going to talk about the need to keep a a uh, story log, story file. Story file comes in very handy when you're writing a book or giving a keynote. Because you tell stories to engage the audience. And you tell stories to make a point. Now, you really need to work on your story file. You need to go back and look at the pain points in your life and jot them down. Because the pain points are what who are the teaching the moments for you and the teaching moments for your audience. They're also the basis of humor. Because tragedy plus time equals humor. So the comedians tell us anyway. One of the pain points I have in my story file is a story about when I was so down and out, I graduated from college and just wasn't able to find a job. I wound up getting kicked out of my house and moving into a cave in the hills above Simi Valley, California. I can remember moving my stuff in and starting to cry. When I, all of a sudden, when my friends came up and said, you got the job. And I was able to move back out of the cave before I actually moved into it. Move back into my house. It's fortunate that I met my wife at that job as well. So just when you think things are way down, can't possibly rebound from your tragedies, things happen. And they happen for the best. Just got to keep grinding, got to keep pushing, and things will work out. Here's a story I tell in my keynotes. If I can remember it off the top of my head now. I'm staring off into a deep, pristine blue sky, doing my Zen thing, just staring at it. And I saw a little dot forming in the sky, and I blinked my eyes a few times because figured something was going on with my eyes and it wasn't, it was a cloud forming. And I watched this thing grow until it was in the shape of the Commonwealth of Virginia. I've been watching the skies for all my life. And I was 66 years old before I saw a cloud actually form in a clear blue sky. I've seen clouds dissipate, I've seen clouds grow together, I've seen clouds start up, but not in a clear blue sky, not from nothing. It's a rare sight, very rare sight. It's kind of like writing. Get your inspiration while you're writing. I'm losing my train of thought because I haven't had my cup of coffee yet, but <laughs> it's kind of like sitting down to write. The inspiration comes while you're writing. If you're not writing when you get the inspiration, the inspiration is going to be long gone. You're going to miss it. So catch the cloud and write.
grab that inspiration, and write. That's it for today. Talk to you tomorrow. Hashtag before my morning coffee. Bye for now.